Okay, so uh, this is the first mask of the day. Uh, this is the uh, standard ear loops <laughs> face mask, which is a great brand name. I mean, they were really, they were really reaching with that one. They really wanted to stand out with the standard ear loops face mask. Um, okay, let's go ahead and put this in the front and put it down. There we go. All right, and we'll hit start button now. Um, I think what standard ear loops was going for is probably their uh, price point, because this is very cheap. It's uh, $10.99 for a 50 pack. I'm just gonna look at the box first. Uh, lightweight, comfortable to wear. <laughs> we'll see about that. Uh, disposable hypoallergenic face mask with three layers. Water repellent, which, uh, fun fact, uh, the FDA doesn't want you to say that unless you are a registered face mask which this is not. All right, let's check out the packaging. So this is really cool because they've got uh, five different uh, colors in here. So we're gonna try out, we're testing the pink. I don't think that necessarily matters. The color it shouldn't anyways. So one of the things, it's a pretty good construction. It, your loop broke, all right. Let's try another one. It seems like a good construction. Okay, your loop broke. This is the thing that I don't like about a lot of the Chinese masks. I'm gonna try two at once and see if it breaks. They both broke. All right, well, assuming that I can get one that doesn't break uh, when I actually put it on my face. Uh, let's try this thing on here. So the first thing I'm noticing is that there's kind of a smell to it, like a chemical smell. And I don't know why a lot of the Chinese masks have this, um, but I, I think the reason why is because they have to come on a boat and it could be like whatever they were packed with, whatever they were in the, in the container with. So that's the first thing I'm, smell, I'm, I'm getting is a smell. The fit is pretty good uh, on this. And again, we're not gonna be talking about fit today. This is just filtration. Um, it's a pretty good construction other than the fact that the ear loops break a lot. Uh, so other than that, what does the test say? Okay, the test just came in and we are at 95.3%. Pretty good, that's pretty good. I'm trying to see if they're making any claims. They're not making any claims. So I would say this is pretty okay. Like, you know, I mean, personally, like I would want to have the best filtration possible, but you know, aside from the ear loops breaking, I would say that the standard ear loop face mask is a good bargain at $11, right? What do you think? They're going to put us out of business or what? Yeah, it is. <laughs>